everybody welcome back to my channel today we're going to be unboxing this month's mtv ice fishing edition it's right here i just got it i haven't opened it yet i just got home too from school this is month of february mtv let's look at it I'm in my room right now. Nice little room. Killed that book. Yep. Nice little book. So first, we've got the Vexen Crystal Reaper Glow Resin Trebles. So these are nice little treble hooks. As you can see. So the glow resin, that's the little beads that are pretty sure that with if you put it under your LED or your jig charger you can put that on your you can buy those separately from your like your Markham and put it on to your fish finder because Markham makes some and so you put it on your your little fish finder and with your fish finder on the ice you put your foot, your boot, on a button, and it turns on the flashlight, and you just dangle your jig over it, and it charges the battery. Now, this is perfect for deep water, dark fishing. So next, we have these Fox Bait Co. Fox Bait Co. These little tungsten tail, tungsten tail soft plastics. They're just white, plain white, soft plastics. Take one out. It's a 10 count of them. No scent, it's just plastic. Plastic scent. That's nice. Perfect for here. Just by where I live, I can go fish for crappies and bluegill. It's nice for little small things. I don't mind the mess, but like, got a whole lot of fishing poles right there. Fishing, fishing, fishing. So that's that. Oh, I see some good stuff in there. Oh, this is the what's inside card. Oh, I haven't looked at that for a while. I usually don't even look at them. But it gives you the prices. So this right here is Lidivia Minnow. It's a rip bait. Rip bait. I'm interested in what this does. Let me check. I'll read on the back for you guys too. So look at that. It's got a snap swivel. Or not snap swivel. Just a snap there. Probably for maximum um, maximum action. Rip baits are so nice for walleye. Especially up in my lax. And if any of you guys here watch this video that fish up my lax, I suggest you go to the mud flaps. Any mud flap you can find, you can throw down a rip bait bigger, this big or bigger. And this is, how big is this? This is, this is a half ounce. I'm not saying how long it is. It's just a half ounce. It's a half ounce bait. It's perfect. You can slam walleye. Slam walleye, slam pike, slam whitefish if you're going for whitefish. And heck, maybe even a burbot would hit it. You never know with these fish here in Minnesota. I'm really interested in what this does. I mean, I don't really know. It says it turns on in water. 
So I guess we're going to have to try it out in this video. So we will be doing that. Next product. Nice. Tungsten jigs. I love these. We got K-Tenders. Tungsten jigs. These are... Five millimeter. Oh, and they glow. They glow too. Need to get that. I'm pretty sure these are the five millimeter or six. Yeah, I think if they are the five millimeter. See, because it's in red, it says five millimeters. This thing would focus. Alright, it doesn't want to focus, but there it is. Nice little jigs. They go, they each have, this one is pink, pink with white dots. You can see it there. The glare is kind of bad, but, yep. And the other one is black with white dots, and it has no eyes. The pink one has eyes. So those are nice. Got catch coal sticker. Perfect for <laughs> anything. Nice. I've been hoping for more soft plastics. I didn't want to go to the store and buy so many. I mean, I'll show you guys what I did buy. And I'll also show you guys what I got from my last month's... Oops, sorry. Dropped you guys. I'll show you guys what I got from last month's box because I forgot to film it. And I just forgot. This isn't it. This is part of it. Sorry guys. I'm just like all over the place in my room. So the so first I'm gonna show you guys what I got from last month's box before I do anything else. So these right here. These little rattle balls. Rattle balls. Yep, rattle balls. You thread your line through it and then you then you tie on your hook and when you've got a plain tungsten jig, it gives that just that much more livelihood. So this is the Trigger X Trigger Trigger X soft plastic bait. There's a ball in the middle and then two like wing sight type strands coming off. That was once last month's. Um we also got She can drop my my camera, and I did get a new camera, guys. Hopefully the quality is all right. So this is my my spoon box. That's what I've got in here. So basically, I've just got all my spoons. You know, got some good spoons. So this silver battle. Battle wrap. This one right here. Silver one. I got that one. I'm so sorry, you guys. I've been dropping everything. I got that one in month's, last month's box. And three new things I got in here is the clam. These, these three aren't part of last month's, but it's clam. Clam. What's that? Clam leech, the leech spoon. I think it's called leech flutter, yeah. The clam leech flutter. I got Northland Macho Middle, and I got the, the Swedish Pimple. Yep. Oh, man. 12 year old here. And so, yeah. Pretty sure that's all. Wait, nope. Never mind, I'm a liar, guys. I'm such a liar. Yep, okay. So, here, it's gonna be kind of hard to take them out, but I'll do it either way. Yep. 
So right here, we have a Rapala, Rapala uh, stand-up jig. It's got a flat jig. So you just jig it like this. It had fins, like the rest of them that you're going to see that I show you. But they broke off because I wasn't caring for it correctly. I put it in my box and I kind of just threw it around. Because my box, I carried it in my pocket while I was fishing and it kind of got thrown around, guys. That just sucks. Because this is a nice bait, too. So. Five dollar bait, I think, which is, you know, but it's all right. I mean, it'll still do its job as a jig. Not like we're gonna die. This one right here, it's another Rapala. I'm pretty sure it's got them fins. See them? And down here, it's got kind of the same. The same treble hook, the same treble hook as these. It's just it comes with it already, and that glows underwater, in deep dark water. So this one I've tested out before. I just didn't film it. When you jig it, it swims to different places. And while I love that, guys, trust me. And then right here, just wait. And you guys can just skip ahead. You really don't need to watch this. Me struggling to get stuff back in its box. Because now I got two new cases. I'm trying to keep everything nice and organized. Make sure that nothing else breaks. So this one right here. This is the Acme. Acme Rattle. Acme... I don't know. It's an Acme jig. It's a um it's a ten gram. It rattles. And this one is big. This one's like heavy. It goes down nicely. It's got built in fins instead of like glued on fins like the other ones. So it don't break off. Only if you really were to snap it. But this plastic is hard and and just thick. Yeah. And so my next one here. Can't get it. Is the Acme Hyperglide. And I put I put a different treble hook on it. Kinda like that Rapala. I put one of those on it. Because the other one was just plain. And so what this one does is it's got wings. That's why they call it the hyperglide. And the wings. See? The wings, when you go down in the water, it glides. It's almost like it's walking, but underwater. And it's also, at the same time, gliding down with the fins. And so it's really light. It's lighter than any other jig they've got. And I got the smaller one. This is the... This is the three gram. It's all plastic. That one's, this one I think is ceramic or metal, the rattle one. But this one also has got built in fins. And this little plastic piece back here, so that when you need to get down deep, you just hook your line on there and it falls down straight. And once you get down, you just give it a really hard jig and it'll be normal. So I got those out of the way. So those are all my, I don't know, just other things. So going on with this month's Lucky Tackle Box. Right here we got Lip Rippers. Floating, floating. Floating, floating. Trout, crappie, bass, and steelhead fake bait. Pretty nice. I don't know if it actually floats. Not too sure right now. I have to just check it out. No, I'm pretty sure it doesn't float. No, yeah, it doesn't float. They just say floating, floating. That might be the type. 
there's that one. Did I already do this one? Yeah. Wait. Oh. Okay. That's interesting. So, they sent another Trigger X. It's just this one is slimmer and doesn't have a tail. And this one, I didn't even notice that. It's a little bit chunkier and has a tail. But they're both black, both 12 count. So, next and last thing of this month's box is these little Widowmaker Lures Tungsten, size 14. Get a tiny thing. So small. You can compare it to my bitten up fingernail. Got really ugly fingernails. Tiny, tiny jig. So that's going to wrap it up for this month's tackle box. And I'm going to go fill a sink with water. And I'll be right back. So guys, I'm back. Actually, I probably shouldn't be back. That was probably five minutes for me, but a second for you guys. For you guys. So right here, I've got the bait. I'm in my bathroom. I'm gonna drop it in. And it's glowing. Isn't that pretty nice? The camera looks a bit different, but in person it's really bright. It's really nice. And then once you take it out, no more. Put it back in. Water. No, no. So yeah, they stand to what they're they cleaned. Pretty nice guys. So I'm gonna get out of my bathroom before someone thinks I'm weird. And that was the video. Thanks for checking it out. I'll see you later.